The talk of the heart of Dixie was last night's Iron Bowl, and oh, what a game it was. Mark Hall was on the plains and looks back on a thrilling win for Auburn. Fourth and 10 from the 22-yard line, nine seconds remaining. A breathtaking finish to one of the most dramatic Iron Bowls in history. I'll just sit there and I'll just sit there and watch. I'm sitting there like every one of you fan, all the fans up here just watching. And uh, like I say, I gotta find some type of peace in, in how to handle this game because it, uh, it tears you up. Yeah. I said it gonna come down to the last play of the game, and uh, we knew we knew that they had to go to the end zone for the uh, for the win, and we just told our DBs just to play smart, just play, don't don't press yourself. Just Auburn seized the 31-27 lead on a 22-yard touchdown run by Fred Beasley, but it was a key third down play that set up the winning score. I mean, he ran a little short crossing route, and then right before he got the middle, he cut straight up the field, and we, we worked on this week for there. They, they, they buddied out too deep and covered doubled your wide outs wide, so as he smashed in, sliced up, it was a critical, critical play. Even though the Alabama defensive unit surrendered 31 points, 16 over average, it earned the respect of its interstate rival. When the ball is thrown to one direction and it's ran in one direction, I mean, every last one of them run to the ball and it's like they swarm around the ball and like they magnets attracted to the ball. Their defense is fast. They get to the ball fast. You know, they're the best, they're the best, they're the best defense we done played by far. Auburn seniors will now play in their first bowl game, an accomplishment that marks a complete turnaround of the Tiger program in the last five years. It seems like we've been through so much that, you know, that's not supposed to happen in, five, in a five-year span where you can go from one end <clears throat> to the next and, and back again. And, you know, and it seems like we've just been in a, in a turn cycle. The victory gives Auburn three in a row against the Tide on the Plains and bragging rights for the next 12 months. In Auburn, Mark Hall, WTVY Sports.